just thought I'd film some behind the scenes thoughts while starting this new transformation. I wanna combine these two dresses together. These have been in my closet for a very long time now and I'm just tired of seeing them in my closet. <laughs> so uh, it's hard because the idea is very fuzzy right now. And I would say this is the most challenging part, not seam ripping, but just not knowing what the end result is going to look like. And I'm just going to dive into it and hope that it turns out good. It's been a while since I done a transformation. So yeah, kind of nervous about that. I feel like um, after my audience on, weird light on me. After my audience on YouTube grew a lot, there was just so many opinions and it kind of ruined, it kind of made transforming clothes not as fun just because I had to think about everyone's opinion and how to please them and oh no, if I do this, someone's gonna have a problem with it and if I do it this way, then like other people are gonna have a problem with it. So I'm finally like, fuck it, I'm gonna, just do it because this is what I love to do and it's my art, you know, it's what I enjoy doing. So I'm just gonna try and continue to be me and hopefully it turns out good and hopefully you guys love it and yeah, the struggle of being on YouTube. All right, I put on a sweater cause it is quite chilly now in my house and I was just watching my family snaps because we have a family snapchat and it's just making me so excited for Thanksgiving to be together with my family. I'm going out to Texas this year because my whole family's going there because my aunt lives over there with her family and seeing like everyone's arriving at different times. I can't wait to also be over there but I'm flying out on Thursday Thanksgiving morning and I'll be there by 11 a.m. so I'll still be there in the morning on Thanksgiving day, but yeah. Just got my hair done. It looks amazing. So excited. Gotta do my face makeup now. I have my hair and makeup done. I'll put my dress on over there because I don't want to be sitting on it in the car. Just check out the back of my hair though. Oh no, I can't zoom facing this way. It looks awesome. Oh, just go as close as I can. Ready to head out for our photo shoot. I actually asked on Instagram if my viewers from San Diego knew good places for us to go to and someone recommended a few people actually recommended the Rancho Bernardo Inn so that's where we are gonna go try and shoot hopefully they allow photography there um, usually we don't aren't allowed to take pictures in places like that but we'll go try I saw online they had a bunch of awesome Christmas trees and it looks very festive so I think it would work very well with this. If not, we'll probably just hit up some other places in San Diego. There's a rainbow right here. It's so pretty. It was raining all day yesterday. It's a little sweet, but it's a pretty rainbow. Spinning gears of gold make noise. A ballerina with such shooting here at the Rancho Bernardo Inn. It's so pretty. Thank you to you guys on Instagram that suggested this location. I think it's perfect for the dress. Here's Eric getting some b-rolls. And then more Christmas trees here. It's beautiful. I love 
those things on top. <laughs> All right, so sad to let my hair down, but it's time. The hairstylist was telling me that when I do take my hair out, there's going to be I'm going to be searching for all the little hair ties that she did to tie all of this up. I think she did a wonderful job. I just walked into the mall salon, and it was just a random hairstylist that ended up doing my hair. So I didn't know if she was going to do a good job or not. I just showed her some pictures, and then. She came up with this, and when she showed me, I was like, oh my god, is this all of my hair? Because my hair is so short. So she was able to give it some volume. So I'm going to undo everything now. Take out um, the bobby pins. So it looks like she... Actually, she just... Um... She only tied this one right here. The rest is all loose and let go of. And then she only put one hair tie here and pinned it here. Okay, I have an idea of how I could do it next time. And the rest of this is just really really curled. Do you guys see that? Since I have a full face on today, I'm just gonna use the Pond's Cream Cold Cream Cleanser and Makeup Remover. I usually just scoop my hair for watching i hope you enjoyed this little behind the scenes vlog don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel i am going to be posting more in december for vlogmas so look forward to those and i'll see you guys next time bye